Hello guys, this video is part of my brand new web scraping in Python using Scrapy and Splash course. So if you are interested in learning web scraping, make sure to enroll. I leave a coupon in the description box so you can buy it with $10 only. Okay, welcome back. Hope you have found the solution and everything went okay for you. If not, follow up with me so you can understand more. So as you can see in the Chrome developer tools, we have two rows. Each one has three columns inside it. And if I expand the first one, you're gonna see that we have a div with the class attribute set to book. So in order to select all the divs that has the class attribute set to book, we only need to write double slash div, and then we're gonna define a predicate. So two square brackets, and inside them, we filter through the class attribute. So add sign class, equal between two quotation marks book you can use contains but it doesn't really make sense since the class attribute has only one value good this xpath expression returned six nodes one two three four five six which is the exact number of books that we have now to select all the books title i'm gonna show you another way on how to locate a particular data on the dom rather than manually expanding the divs and reading the HTML markup. So, if you select this book title, and then right-click on it, and then click on Inspect, it gets automatically selected on the Chrome Developer Tools. Good. So the title is an H3 node that has two classes, book-title and card-header. Here we have two options. We can use contains, but since the book-title class is in the first position, we can use starts-with function. So in the search box, we're gonna select all the H3 nodes, and inside the predicate, we call starts-with. The first parameter will be the class attribute, and the second parameter will be book-title. And like this, we select all the book's titles. Now, just underneath the card-body div, you can see that we have an H5 node with two classes, card-title and author. So this time, we can't use starts-with because the author class is not in the first position. Instead, we have to use contains. So I'm going to change H3 to h5 and starts with two contains and the class value will be author so like this we select all the authors name now the last thing is to get the year of publish so i'm gonna select this one and then right click on it and then inspect so the year of publish is just a paragraph tag with the class attribute set to year dash publish it. It's pretty easy. So in the search box, we want to select all the paragraph tags and inside the predicate, we're gonna target those who have the class attribute equal to year dash publish it. And that's it.